What is up guys, this is Born Power 35 here and today I have um kind of a multi-purpose video for you guys. Um I'm gonna be accomplishing three things in this video. Um two I'm gonna be talking about and one you'll be seeing in this gameplay. Um as you guys know, I don't do um, Road to Gold, Road to Diamond, Road to Dark Matter. But I was uh, scrolling through my custom classes about uh, two weeks ago, and I was looking at my coot up, and I was just looking at some camos to see which camos I had. Um, and I was looking at all my, my multiplayer one, and I seen that I only needed two camos left to get it gold. So I was like, okay, these are two relatively easy challenges to complete. Um, it just took me a little while because one for one of the challenges I didn't have a perk that I needed um, to be able to uh, actually it was a wild card so that I could have six attachments. So I had to wait a little while, but um, I finally have the video for you guys. Um, this is my first ever gun that is going to be gold. I think I needed like 15 kills left with six attachments, um, which was relatively easy. I was getting like. 15 to 20 kills a game with um with this gun and the setup that I have um I have a best class setup for this video or for this gun I'll link it in the uh in the description um but I also want to talk about a couple of different things so I was watching some YouTube video YouTubers um you know just so that I can get ideas you know on what I want to do with my channel you know just to refresh things you know keep keep my channel you know, vibrant, and you know, see what's working for other people, and see how I can adapt and twist it to to help me out. So what I want to do is I watch a bunch of different YouTubers, um, and the there was there's some ones that do news videos, so I've been trying to do some news videos, and uh, the past couple of days there's been a couple of interesting different um things that have come out. And the first one is regarding the tenth specialist. Now everybody's been you know freaking out over if we're gonna get this in a supply drop or not I mean I could care less um, the way the tent specialist is gonna work I don't think I'm actually gonna be using him um, but this it's almost confirmed like it's all but confirmed that it's gonna be the black market dealer and his name is gonna be blackjack his ability is gonna be that while you're using him um, with his ability on and you kill another opponent or opponent with their specialist weapon or ability activated then you can um, steal their weapon or ability now we didn't know you know you know his real identity until the other day a um, I want to say somebody on Twitter posted a picture it was a side-by-side -side picture of Danny Lee from the campaign and the black market dealer they were posed in the exact same way they both have the exact same tattoo on their arm and they both have the exact same cup um so this is too many coincidences to to just overlook that the tenth specialist may be his real identity may be Danny Lee from the campaign we already have somebody from the campaign as a specialist the the seraph character she is from the from the uh from the campaign which is really cool because they're linking campaign with multi or yeah campaign with multiplayer which i find as a great great thing excuse me um that would be awesome i really hope and right here is where i actually got my my gold camo for my uh cuda so uh, i actually have a gold gun now um i don't know how far i am on a bunch of other different weapons um, but I really want to get you guys some more gold guns, but those will be videos for another day. Um, actually a little side note, my PlayStation has decided it does not want to turn on. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to send it back to Sony and have them, uh, either fix it or send me a new one. Luckily it's still under warranty. Actually I haven't had it longer. I bought it right before Black Ops 3 came out. So it's only been out. I've only had it relatively about six months. Um, which this kind of sucks because I'm having to um, actually wait to post videos. So if there's a like a stretch of time where you don't see any videos from me, um, actually what I'm probably gonna do is start vlogging a little bit more while I'm not um, doing uh, these videos. Um, but yeah, uh, um, I'm really sorry that this is happening. Um, but hopefully, hopefully I can get it back relatively quickly. 
um, just so that I can, you know, continue making videos for you guys because I really enjoy making videos for you guys. Um, I know they don't get very many views, very many likes, but I, I still enjoy making videos for you guys. Now on to my, um, the, the other part of this video. There was also, today I was watching a YouTuber, um, um, and he, he was saying that a friend of his was in the Xbox store looking at the backwards compatible games from Xbox 360 to, um, Xbox One. And there was an interesting title that popped up in the uh, backwards compatible um, section of the Xbox Live Store, and it was Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Now we know that we've heard rumors that Infinity Ward is going to be remastering of um, COD 4 and Modern Warfare 2, which is COD 4 is Modern Warfare 1. For those of you who don't know, um, two of the greatest Call of Duties um, in history. And uh, making them as a possible pre-order bonus for Call of Duty 2016, um, which we'll, I'll do a separate video on that later. Um, I know I'm a little late on it, but I want to do a video for you guys on it. Um, that would be great. And this guy, he he went into the, the store and found this um, Modern Warfare 2 in the backwards compatible section of Xbox Live. So he went to go click on it. And it unfortunately brought up an error, which means it's not actually in the Xbox Live Store. But it's interesting to note that they actually, you know, have it in there. And, you know, that goes to show you that we may be getting a backwards compatible version of Modern Warfare 2 if we don't get it for a pre-order bonus in, a, in Black, for the new Call of Duty 2016. But yeah, guys. Um, comment in the comment section on which, um, if you would like to see a Modern Warfare 2 as backward compatible for Xbox 360 to Xbox One, and even for PlayStation 3 to Xbox One. Um, but yeah guys, um, thank you for watching the video, like, um, this video, um, subscribe to the channel for more videos, I'll have a couple of videos going up over the next couple of days, I'll be posting a vlog. Let me guys know if you want to see me vlog in the meantime while I can't post any um, Call of Duty videos. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. Um, see you on the next video.